Hey guys, welcome to another video and today we are talking about something exciting. We are talking about MIUI 13 based on Android 12. Basically, we are talking about Xiaomi.eu and till now, you know, the status was that if you want to install this particular update, you had to connect the phone to your computer and install it using Fastboot. Now, they have released a recovery edition of this. There is a specific Orange Fox version which is recommended that I've already flashed. So, I'll show you the step-by-step -step guide of how to install MIUI 13 based on Android 12 xiaomi.eu on your Mi 11X. Now, before we get into the details, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit the notification bell icon because it doesn't cost you anything and it really motivates us to make amazing content like this. If you think you like chatting with like-minded people, well, please join us on Telegram. We have more than 1500 members there and you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. And last but not the least, if you think the hard work is worth the effort, please click on the join button and support the channel. Now, without further ado, hello, awesome people. Welcome to Phone Ops. My name is Kailash. Let's get going. All right, so first, let's get this right. Let's see what we have. We are on MIUI 12.0.3 and we are going to go to 13.0.2. Now understand that this particular port that we are talking about from Xiaomi.eu is based on the 13 stable, which was released for Elliot. That is the Chinese variant. Now, why I'm saying this, I'll tell you that after flashing, because there are some things which will be missing and how to fix that, there'll be a video coming on that later, but it's completely usable. The ROM is completely usable. So we are on the first ever Indian update, MI year 12.0.3, things that you need to take care of. Well, you need to make sure your phone has more than 50% battery. You need to have an unlocked bootloader. Okay. You need to have a special version of Orange Fox recovery installed. It's a flashable zip. You can flash it through your TWRP and you will be booting into that recovery. So no rocket science there. And the most important thing, make sure you have backed up all the information on your device's internal storage. Because a clean install is highly recommended, we will be doing format data. So please make sure you've backed up all the information. You need to also ensure that you go to settings, you remove all your Google account, your face unlock, your fingerprint unlock, pin, pattern, passcode, everything. Also remove your MI account. Don't be signed into your MI account and then reboot the device once. Now, once you've taken care of all of those, there is just one file that you need. That is the MI UI 13 recovery file, which is linked in the description. It is around three to three and a half gigabytes. So please make sure you have a good internet connection when you go ahead and download it. Now we are ready to flash. The reason you see a cable connected over here is because I have a OTG pen drive connected and that's where my recovery file is. The recovery ROM is what you're talking about. Now, in order to go to recovery, press and hold volume up and power. Keep it pressed till the time you see the MI logo. Okay. There you go. We are booting into Orange Fox recovery now. Now, this is the exact version that I was referring to. The link for this particular recovery is also mentioned in the description. Okay, this is the one. So if you just flash this through normal TWRP, it will flash this recovery and reboot into Orange Fox and then you will have the screen. So we will select USB OTG over here. As you can see, the recovery file is over here. MIUI 13, we'll go to wipe, Dalvik data. That's all that we are wiping and we can wipe internal storage as well. That's fine because our file is on the OTG pen drive. If your file is on the internal storage, don't wipe internal storage. Okay. Now go to the install screen and select this particular ROM and select swipe to install. Now understand this is the ROM, which is three to three and a half gigabytes. So it will take a good two to three minutes to flash. So please be patient while that happens. All right. Now, as you can look at the screen, the flashing has gone just fine. There is no error whatsoever. You can select to wipe caches. Now, one thing left to do over here is you need to reflash the recovery. Reason being because we flashed the ROM, it would have been overwritten, right? Now to install the recovery, I'll show you that once again over here. Go to USB OTG. Orange Fox, unofficial, this is the file, as you can see. Okay, so the recovery is installed. Last step to do is go to format data and type in yes. Reboot system, 
you may now disconnect the OTG pen drive if you have one connected. Now the first boot of course, this is MIUI, it will take anywhere between two to three minutes. So please be patient while that happens. You see the new MI Splash logo over here. All right, so just like that, we have booted to the home screen of MIUI 13, as you can see over here, it's the same old MIUI. Now, remember I said that uh, this is released for the Chinese version of this device and uh, our device, the Indian Mi 11X is a Elliot in. Now, what happens because of that is some features which are ideally supposed to work on this device go missing. Important features like the option to change your refresh rate, MEMC and all those things like the, you know, features which enhance your video watching experience and stuff are sort of missing here. So let me quickly, you know, get into the main screen and I'll show you what is missing. And maybe tomorrow or day after, I will show you a video in which how you can go ahead and install Majisk and then get those features back. So let's wait for the phone to enter the home screen. All right, so we are on the home screen now. Let's go to settings over here and let's go to my device. As you can see, this is 13.0.2 with Android 12 and the latest security patch. Not exactly the latest, we are in the month of January. This is a December security patch. So if we actually go to display over here, you will see that you don't really have any options. You can't even change the screen refresh rate and it will be stuck at 60. So there is a way to go ahead and fix this. Let me know in the comment section if you want me to make a dedicated video on how to go ahead and fix the refresh rate toggle and stuff like that. So all in all, this is an easy step-by-step -step guide to install MIUI 13 with Android 12 on your Mi 11X, Redmi K40 and the Poco F3. Let me know what do you think about this video. Until the next one, this is Kalash signing off at PhoneOps. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.